And we're back. And we're heading on up here. Alright, let's do this. And oh, It looks like I should have gotten a power up. Oh. kind of cool um, oh sweet no, I was afraid to have to just lay a whole bunch of bombs there okay. I don't know if anybody else ever experiences this but don't you hate it when like ooh, nine metroids okay and there's a little egg apparently um, I just realized, did I have... Did it give me a thing, or is this part of the nest still, I guess? Okay, I guess it's part of the nest, technically. Ah, one of them! Um, I think I'm gonna use regular missiles on those guys now, uh, if there's more of them. Log entry. Genetics laboratory. Okay, suspended above an abandoned city are the remains of a laboratory. Scanners confirmed there was extremely sophisticated equipment to be found, along with scientific data of incalculable mag magnitude. Only stasis tanks are left. Organic traces within suggest genetic research and DNA manipulation. Biogenic substances of an unknown age coat the lab laboratory's walls. Okay. Um, let's actually... Give me something else. Ah, oh, freaking! Ah, oh, came out of nowhere. <sighs> okay, yeah, you gotta fire those five missiles fast. Sheesh, I freaking hate these things. <laughs> Just gonna walk around like this. Just reveal them. <laughs> okay, there we go. There's a good strategy. Just refreeze. Ooh. Man, those things are nerve wracking. What is this stuff? I just know there's gonna be more of them. As soon as I get to like a place where it's hit that is <laughs> oh man I don't like this okay cool oh <laughs> why are those like the most scary ones <laughs> they're technically the freaking weakest oh no that was not good not good not good Like, I can feel the heart palpitations. Okay, there was another one there. Is, is this the end? This looks really familiar from 
I like I kind of remember like the very beginning area. I like, remember the little like that path that led you to the first Alpha Metroid, like where you saw it hatch and stuff. And then I vaguely remember like these little spiky things that led up to the queen. I think this might be it. Holy crap! Yep, this is it. Um, that's not working. Okay, let's take a look here. Uh, the only Metroid organism naturally capable of producing offspring, the queen is the heart of the species and mother of every Metroid born on SR388. Her role in the hive has hindered her mobility yet encouraged the development of a long neck and massive head to strike at a distance. Her cell structure indicates she is heavily aged, possibly as old as the lab she is settled in. The years have reinforced her torso to impenetrable levels. The queen's genetic coding is distinct from other Metroids and she may have gone through a unique life cycle to attain her form. Oh, freaking A, man. I can't remember. Oh, okay, so, yeah. Okay, can't shoot her while that's active. Oh, nice. Ow. Okay, so you can't screw attack those things. Like, I need those super missiles. Ow. Worth it. No, super missile. Crap, regular missiles are all that's left. I got a couple more super missiles. Oh, that's uh, not good. Ow. Oh, the fight's moving. Wasted it. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what I needed. Ah, oh, frick. Ah. Oh, frick. How was I supposed to dodge that? Oh, man. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. This sucks. Crap. How the heck do I fend that thing off? Okay, yeah, I mean, we're basically at the end here. I'm just gonna keep going. Um. Okay, I think I kind of remember where the Metroids were from before, so I think I should be able to get through here pretty quick. Um, yeah, I think this is this one's gonna be the finale. All right. Right, let's... Um, okay, I thought it had an entry for... Oh, yeah, there we go. Clear that out.
Oh, yeah, the rooms that lock have the Metroid's derp. better than I thought it would once they both showed up. So let's let him get above me, and then the power-ups just drop on my head. Nice. Ah, I keep wasting one. fast after that happens oh sheesh Fast, move fast. Okay, I think I'm doing better than it was the last time. more power-ups here. Okay, uh, I'm doing better now. Ah, freaking... Like, there's no winning in that spot. Ah! That sucked. Like, that was, that was just a horrible showing that time. I need super missiles. <laughs> Tough. 
Okay, I got this, I got this. Okay. Ah! Jerk. Where am I? Okay. Oh, that's, that's a real interesting little mechanic that they got there for the end of the fight. Oh my gosh, I pulled it off. <laughs> oh man. All right. Whew. I just gotta, I just gotta check one last time, make sure they're not missing anything in here. Oh my gosh. Let's see, wait, can I get back up there? Nope. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, there's a little babby Metroid. Oh, and it eats the little goopies. That's right. I forgot about that. So I think, is this the only Metroid game that doesn't end with a, like... Apparently this is like Metroid food or something? Um... Yeah, I almost forgot about this. Like, this is where you meet the baby Metroid that comes into play in Super Metroid. You know, like, saves your life in that and everything. Or, sorry, spoilers. <laughs> Um, all right. Yeah, so I think this is like the only Metroid that doesn't end with like you having to race the, against the clock, get out of the exploding something or other in two minutes and... Because <laughs> I know the original Metroid did it and Zero Mission by extension. Um, Zero Mission technically does it twice um, because it kind of extends the story of the original a little bit. Um, Metroid Fusion does it, I know. Um, I think Super Metroid. That's actually, I've actually never played that one, oddly enough. I should probably change that. Um, let's see, and what else? Um, you know, I can't remember the Prime games too well. I remember liking them, but I just can't remember if that was a thing that happened in them. Oh, wow, I'm so close to being dead. That was... Man. That was actually really cool, though, how it like, burst through the rooms and stuff. And Yeah, there we go. That's how we get out here. All right, and then my ship is over this way. Ah, darn it. So I'm gonna just fly over this whole section. <laughs> Didn't have it quite spaced right. Um, but yeah, I can't remember how the Prime games ended. I think something exploded, so it's kind of funny. Uh, almost landed perfectly. All right, so this one's a little bit longer, but this, this is a finale. Um, here, so awesome. All right, let's see what they put at the end here. Another Metroid 2 remake. Producer Milton Dr. M64. Um, is that Guasti? Um, oh, yeah, Night Strike. So I know he didn't, he worked mostly on it by himself, but he's got these, he had other, he did have some help. Like, I think some people helped with providing um, uh, sprite, like certain, like specific sprites and things. And I know, I don't think he did all the music and stuff. So, um, though he did do some. But that's cool. Oh, and I guess you put everybody's names on there that did playtesting, like, in a more official capacity, because I think there were beta versions that he put out and stuff, but he, I guess he had specific people doing that, so that's really cool. Capcom? Huh, that's an interesting one to see there. On the list. <laughs> did they help him in some way? Or is it just like, hey, thanks, um... 
Maybe did they make the tool that he? Because I think he used some, like some video game making game program or something. But that's cool. Yeah. So, um, this is a blast, man. And uh, it's also kind of cool that it came out to exactly thirty episodes. <laughs> So it filled up six perfect weeks there. Aw. Memory of Satoru Iwata. That's really cool. Just over six hours. 97%? What was I missing? Huh. Okay. Um... Well, I guess I'll just go back on my own and try to look to see where I missed something there. But yeah, cool. Samus has got a little baby Metroid now. And oh yeah, and the see you next mission. That's awesome. The last Metroid. Oh, cool. The galaxy is at peace. Or is it? All right, I just gotta check if he's got like a new game plus. No, it looks like it just pops you right back here, so. Okay, well, um, this was a super fun ride. Um, thanks for watching everybody. Like this was just a blast. Um, if you like the video, tick that like button, tick that subscribe button as well so you get updates when new content drops on the channel. And do remember that there is no IRL, just AFKs, and we'll see you next time that Almo plays a game. Um, I gotta figure out what what next uh, what next I want to play there. So, um, yeah, peace out.